Good morning. My girlfriend, she was very annoyed yesterday. I will tell you about this. Now first I want to apologize. You know, yesterday I talked about this book that I'm reading right now. And I make this mistake quite often. When I talk, I believe that people understand me perfectly. <laughs> and they don't. Well, some did understand what I was saying yesterday, but in order to understand what I was saying about this book, you had, you had to know me very, very well. See? So I'll try again. So I'm reading this book. It's called Busting Anti-Vax Myths. It's a funny book. <laughs> it's a satire. It's actually written by one of us. The guy who wrote it is a viewer of this channel. It's a satire. And it's supposed to be written by this guy, Oshin McAmadon. It's a made-up name. The, the name actually means son of stupid in Irish. And he's like a mix of all these stupid experts that we have listened to over the last few years. So that's what this book is about. And it's very, very funny. Yeah, as I said, I'm reading it right now. I'm laughing hard. We need a good laugh, I think. I, I certainly do. The last few years has been quite depressing, almost. That's very good. And you can get it. You can get the book. The link will be below. All right? I think I got it this time. <laughs> All right. So now my girlfriend, she was super annoyed yesterday. And then she told me about it. And I want to tell you about it. So, she's got a friend. Her name is Susanne. And they have known each other for a long time. My girlfriend really likes her. This l lady, Susanne. She's quite aware of certain things. And then it all changed in 2020. Now, this lady, tw uh, Susanne, she posted something on her Facebook page. This is why my girlfriend was so annoyed. And I want to read it to you. And I think you will understand. Okay. So this is the post from Susanne on Facebook. Well, yes, then it was time for me to get the virus. But of course, it feels reassuring as I had three cups of tea. Go get the tea. Those of you who haven't, because it started again and stay at home at the slightest symptoms so that you protect those who for various reasons cannot drink tea. And then there were replies, you know, comments, there was a thread. Uh, one was from her mother, Susanne's mother. But my little darling, what bad luck. Take good care of yourself. Hugs, mom. And then there was a friend who said this. Hope it will be okay for you. I got super sick. With breathing difficulties for about three days. Before, before it turned around, despite three cups of tea. I'm super glad I had them. Otherwise, I don't know what could have happened. Big hug. <laughs> Yeah. And my girlfriend, I don't know if she will reply to this. I think she will today. But she didn't so far. And I think this is one of the reasons she's so annoyed with it. See, this is, this is what I do. If I get annoyed, I just say something. I just say it. And I get it out of my system. So I think she will comment on this today. Now, I asked my girlfriend if I, it was okay f for me to comment. <laughs> and my girlfriend said, yeah, of course, comment. And then I couldn't because I'm not a friend on Facebook. I'm, I'm not her friend, you see, so I couldn't comment. So I will do it here on this video, right? So this is my comment to Susanne.
something like this. Suzanne, I am so sorry about this. Big hugs. Uh, I didn't get the tea. I didn't take it. I didn't drink it. None of it. Today I regret it so much because now reading about your experiences uh, I understand what a big success this is. I should really have taken it. But now it's too late. I can't take it now. I don't think so. But I totally regret it. All right. Big hugs. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it's mind-blowing, isn't it? It's amazing. We talked about it, my girlfriend and I, about this. The fact that this lady was pretty good, decent, intelligent. Well, maybe she wasn't. I don't know. She appeared to be. And then this. And we talked about this. This propaganda was very successful, wasn't it? This massive propaganda from mainstream media and the experts, the politicians. Crazy. She actually believes this stuff. Right. Alright, so the good the book is a satire. <laughs> and you can get it. The link will be below. Alright. Be good. <laughs>